you follow high school sports? The San Diego Union Tribune's free UT Preps app is the go-to source for your favorite high school sports teams. Get schedules, scores, standings, news, and more right on your phone. Follow your favorite high school team by sport. Share photos and videos right from the game. See rosters and player profiles complete with game-by-game -game statistics and receive push notifications for game updates. Don't miss any of the action at Oceanside, Chula Vista, Torrey Pines, and many more San Diego schools. Download the free UT Preps app on Google Play or the Apple App Store. Now, when it comes to sports, it's not always about the wins and the losses, but the brotherhood and the friendships that you cultivate along the way. One Christian high school senior learned just how important those friendships are when he needed to call on his Patriots teammates for help through the most difficult time of his life. Meet Jason Lyon, a young man who is truly one in a million. This was in definitely uh, a curveball, for sure. Uh, Definitely a curveball that, that we're, we're, we're going to hit out of the park. Like a typical teen, Jason looked forward to his senior year, ready to suit up for his final season as a three-sport varsity athlete in football, soccer, and baseball, while continuing to maintain his 4.4 GPA and embrace his role as ASB vice president. But in June, he was diagnosed with a one-in-a-million brain tumor, transforming his perspective on life. So it's called DIPG, it stands for Diffused Intrinsic Pontinglioma, and um, it's a tumor, it's a cancer of the brain stem. Um, so surgery um, is not an option because if you were to remove um, the cancerous tissue and the cancer cells, um, you, would, you would remove the good stuff as well, and we don't, we don't want to lose that. Um, daily life isn't isn't easy around here, you know, I'm, I'm in a wheelchair, I'm, my parents are showering me, it's very, very humiliating, not humiliating, but humbling. <laughs> I think it's been so humbling for him to like not be able to walk and like many days like so weak and like to show up. Sometimes he wears an eye patch because his symptoms are he has double vision and then he's um, got left-sided weakness. DIBG is one in a million, um, so. One in a million. Yeah, one in a million, <laughs> yeah. You're one in a million. I'm one in a million, that is true. <laughs> a lot of times, God puts these situations and you don't see the good at the moment, um, you, but you will understand later. Not once has Jason felt pity towards his situation, but instead has gained a sense of humility and clarity towards life. I um, truly see um, the vanity and the folly in our ways and just the things that we seek after and things that we pursue after and how empty they really all are, um, and no matter how, no matter how much how important we think we are, or what we are chasing after, I've been gifted by God to see beyond that. I feel like my blindfold um, just of of things that were important in this world just it's amazing. It's like seeing the world for the first time. I learn from Him so much every day. Um, the purpose of life, um, why we're here, what we should be doing with. Our, our daily energies and um, how many people he has touched um, and how many people have touched him. Since receiving the news, the Lyon family has been overwhelmed with support. From messages, food, and prayers, the outpouring of unity reminds them daily they have a community standing lion-hearted behind them. The Christian High football team has gone as far as dedicating their entire season to Jason, and every week a new player wears his number. It, it pains me deeply that um, how far my, my words fall short of expressing my gratitude. Uh, I am deeply, I, I, I can't say thank you. I wish I was physically adept to do more than say thank you because thank you doesn't, thank you doesn't, it's not cutting it for me right now. For now, he hopes his story will continue to make an impact on those around him. My deepest hopes and my deepest prayers is that, uh, that I can have that impact um, on my friends. I pray that is the right impact um, and that they uh, never feel bitterness um, towards the situation, towards God. Um, and I thank the Lord um, that so far um, that hasn't been a situation that they've responded um, as I feel uh, the Lord would have wanted them to respond to the situation how, um, in turn, which is how I wanted them to respond to the situation. So they've really been fantastic. Um, I pray that they continue, continue to uh, receive the impact that this was meant to have. Jason Lyon, courageous, strong, and truly one in a million. I'm one in a million, that is true.